Hi boys and girls, my name is Mr. Harty. Some of you will know me, some of you won't, so nice to see you all. Today we're going to be focusing on rolling, but always, first of all, we'll do a practice of a fitness, a little bit of a warm up. There's going to be four videos. One's going to be the fitness, then there are three others. You don't have to do them all one by one, you can do them different days, different hours of the days, stuff like that. What equipment you'll need today is a tennis ball. So I'm going to be using tennis balls. You could even use rolled up socks if you don't have this equipment. I'm going to use a football for a bigger ball, but if you have a bouncy ball, basketball, there's always an option. And for a target, I'm going to be using this washing basket as a marker. So I'm going to be trying to hit this marker or the washing basket. If you need a little bit of time to collect all the equipment, pause the video now and then push resume when you're ready. And we're back boys and girls. Really good to see that you've got all your stuff ready. We're going to be playing one of my favourite games, and some of you already know this. This is called the traffic light game. So in the traffic light, there's a green light, orange light, and a red light. And by you can guess, the red light means stop, and you freeze as quickly as you can. Orange light is always going to be a little jog on the spot. So not your fastest, just a little jog. And green light is going to be how fast can you go. You're going to keep it going, keep it going, and red light, you freeze. Do you think we understand? Perfect, so look, orange light, we always start a little bit soft, nice and soft, and then green light, we go nice and fast, keep going, keep going, who's gonna be the fastest in this bus? Keep going, keep going, and red! Nice, good speed. Ready? We're gonna go again, we're gonna go straight away with green! We're gonna keep it going, quick, 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 quick. Who's the fastest, go on, move the legs, move the legs. Orange light. Just a small jog. Nice and soft. Nice and soft. Green! Good! Great reaction! Keep it going! Love it. Orange! Green! Red! Good speed. Well done. So, we're going to change what green light means now. Green light is going to be high knees. Okay? How high can you get your knees? So, ready? To so start, always going to have orange. Orange! <laughs> Orange, keeping it nice and slow. Orange, green, high knees. Keep it going. Can you get your knees to hit your hands? Keep going. Orange, this is where you get your breather. Breathing, keep jogging. No one's allowed to stop until I say red light. Whoa, no one's moving. Well done. Ready? Orange. Keep the speed. Never too fast. Can't go too slow either. Go on then. Green light. High knees. Keep them going. You can do it. Good. Well done. Orange. Well done, all of you. Keep going. Okay, and red light. I'm watching. Perfect. Now, we're going to change green light to jumping. So watch this. When I say green light, we're going to jump. Springing our legs. So my knees bend, we jump up. Bend my knees up, bend my knees up. Ready? So now, orange. Keep it going. Nice and slow. Then we go green, we spring. Up and down, bending our knees. Up and down like a kangaroo. Who can touch the sky? Whoa. 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 Orange. Little jog. Little jog. Little jog. Green. Whoa. Whoa. Big jumps. Bending our knees. Red. Good. Ready? We're gonna add in one other color. So green light is gonna be us running our fastest now. And my favorite color is pink. So pink is now gonna be a jumping jack. So watch this, we have to do a jumping jack, okay? Ready? Get a breather. Big breath. Okay, orange, always. Always the same. Then we're gonna go into pink. Ooh. 
Perfect, good. Who can stretch their legs out? Orange. And green's going to be sprint. Who can be the fastest? Little taps on the feet. Oh, keep going, keep going. Bump the elbows. And red. Perfect. Well done, you guys. Absolutely smashed it. I'm trying to get my breath back. So I think you guys might be as well, but you're pretty fitter than me. <laughs> so, well done guys, pause the video here. We're gonna get moving on to the next thing. Five, four, three, two. Perfect, well done for earlier. I've just caught my breath back, so hopefully you have as well. We're gonna be moving on to our rolling now. Okay, I've got three tennis balls, but if you've got one, you can just roll it, and then you have to try and get it afterwards, okay? So watch this. I'm gonna move over to my red ball over here. This is where I'm always going to stand when I roll. All I want to see us do is trying to roll the ball on the floor so it has no bounces. Okay, it has no bounces. I've tried my go, I'm just going to go and collect my three tennis balls. If you've got one, no rise, you can just grab your one. So, the whole idea of rolling is to make sure there's no bounces on the tennis ball. So, I don't want to see any like this. I want to see them nice, stay on the floor stays on the floor. Perfect. So it's always brushing through the grass. Well done. So again, I collect the balls, I set myself up to where I want to go. I'm going to go nice and low. And roll the ball. Perfect. Who can make sure they have the least amount of bounces? So if you have one bounce, can you try and get zero? If you have two bounces, can you try and get one? But look, there's no bounces. If you think you can do that now and there's no bounces, we're going to move on to our next part, okay? What you'll need for the next part is now a target. So mine from earlier was the washing basket. I'm going to set it up just in front of my ball so I can roll it. First thing I want to do when I'm rolling is if I'm right-handed, which I am, I'm going to put my left knee up and my right knee down. So my left arm is not blocked by my knee. Second thing I'm going to do is always point to my target. The idea of it is I want my fingers to brush through the grass. Because if I let go too late, it's going to go up in the air. Well, I don't want I've got no bounces. It brushes through the grass. Ready? Brush through the grass. Oh, great strike, Tom. Okay, look again. Point my knees up. This knee's down. I want to roll through the grass. Two points to me. Again, ready? Always pointing. I bring my arm back to get more power and I brush through the grass. Oh, so close. Let me try again so we can practice that. So straight away, some things we need to do is that my left knee stays up in the air, my right knee touches the floor. Again, my left hand points because it doesn't have the ball in that one. And to get more power, I want my arm to go further back for less power, I bring my hand closer. So look, I go back, brush through the grass. Ooh, so close. Ready? Getting closer. I might need to do that a little bit harder. So look, my hand goes back and I brush. Ooh, well done. I'm gonna try this a little bit longer. If we find it too hard and we can't make the distance, I might actually go a little bit closer. So it's easier. Yes. Brush through the grass constantly. I'm gonna point rush through the grass and I know there's some experts out there if you are finding this easy you might go further back and maybe try and go against me go quite far back so I point rush through the grass yes oh that one had a big bounce so I need to brush the grass a little bit more there it is nice let's make this into a challenge if you think you're ready you can carry on if you're not quite ready and you want to practice a little bit Pause the video and practice. If you're ready though, get yourself some balls, or if you've got one, you can just keep going. You're gonna have five chances to get as many points as you can. If you get it in the basket, I'm gonna give you 10, 10 solid points. If you hit the basket, it's gonna be worth five. If you don't hit it, zero, okay? Watch, I go down on one knee. Oh, left knee always. Point to my target, I brush through, I got it in, that's 10 points to me to start off with. I point, brush my fingers through, 
didn't hit anything, so that's zero. So, so far I've had two goes. I've got 10 points. Always pointing. Brush my fingers through. Oh, I'm not doing so well now. So, okay. As I'm finding it a little bit harder, I'm going a little bit closer to help myself out. So I go a little bit closer. Left knee up, right knee down, always pointing. I want my fingers to brush through the grass. Oh, just hit it, so I'm on 15. I've got two more throws. One more now. Hit it again. So in total, I got 20 points. See if you guys can beat that. If you can, fantastic. If you can't, try throughout the day and see how much better it gets. Well done there. See you soon. Well done today, boys and girls. Fantastic. I thought you tried a lot of stuff. Go back to it and do it again. So don't just do the skill once. You might have to try it twice, three times to get better and better. Because I was never that good when I first started. So now we're going to ask you three questions. But before I ask you the questions, can you try and get your parent or carer to get you a piece of paper and a pencil to write down? So I'll give you 10 seconds. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Five, four, three, two, and one. If the parents are care out there, fantastic. If you could write down these questions for your children to write an answer, that'd be fantastic. Our first question is going to be, what was the first game we played and what was it called? So we had freeze was one of them. We had jogging and then we had different ones where we had to move faster. Can you remember what that game was called? That's your first question. Your second question is, when we're rolling the ball, we don't want to see the ball do what? Okay, we don't want to see the ball do what? Can you remember? So when we're rolling, we don't want to see the ball do what? That's your second. The third question, might have given a little clue with the video before, but when we're rolling, what do we want our fingers to brush through? Okay, you might want to go back and have a little look, or if you can remember, fantastic. Those are your three questions. Let me know how you do. Well done today, guys. See you later.